published 8.12 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 23rd of June 2018, updated 15.24 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 23rd of June 2018. She has recently been spending some quality time with her eldest son Brooklyn during a trip to Paris, in the midst of Fashion Week, and Victoria Beckham continued to bond with her boy at the Diorom show in Paris on Saturday, as they sat with Kate Moss, Lenny Kravitz and Naomi Campbell at the event. Mother of four, 44, flashed a glimpse of her baby blue lace bralette in a matching sheer turtleneck blouse. Fro, Victoria Beckham continued to bond with son. Brooklyn at the Diorom show in Paris on Saturday, as they sat with Kate Moss, Lenny Kravitz and Naomi Campbell at the event. Family affair, Victoria looked delighted to be spending the day with her eldest child up in the ante. The Spice Girl donned a pair of red wide leg trousers, tied in with her platform heels. Victoria swept her tresses into a sophisticated updo to reveal her radiant complexion, enhanced with neutral toned makeup. Her son Brooklyn also put on a stylish display in a white sweatshirt which was littered with tiny bees. Teasing, the mother of four, 44, flashed a glimpse of her baby blue lace bralette in a matching sheer turtleneck blouse upping the ante. The Spice Girl donned a pair of red wide leg trousers, tied in with her platform heels my boy. The 19-year-old budding photographer was sat next to his mum on the front row, who proudly slung a protective arm around him a list, Victoria swept her tresses into a sophisticated updo to reveal her radiant complexion, enhanced with neutral toned makeup as she sat alongside Kate Moss, Lenny Kravitz and Naomi Campbell. the 19-year-old budding photographer was sat next to his mum on the front row, who proudly slung a protective arm around him. Also, in attendance at the star-studded event were veteran models Kate Moss and Naomi Campbell, who made sure to show the youngsters how to do it. Kate, who was perched alongside Posh, looked radiant in a silk golden jumpsuit, which she dressed up with an array of chain necklaces. Fashion Pals, Kate, who was perched alongside Posh, looked radiant in a silk golden jumpsuit, which she dressed up with an array of chain necklaces radiant, looking typically cool the 44-year-old hung a long grey blazer front her shoulders as she took her rightful place on the fro catwalk ready, in keeping with her usual shabby chic style. The catwalk queen wore her golden dress in a loose wavy style, while accentuating her model looks with light touches of makeup looking typically cool. The 44-year-old hung a long grey blazer front her shoulders as she took her rightful place on the fro. In keeping with her usual shabby chic style, the catwalk queen wore her golden dress in a loose wavy style, while accentuating her model looks with light touches of makeup. Meanwhile, Naomi was in keeping with the androgynous theme as she wowed in a cream suit from the French luxury designer, pairing the look with purple aviators and silver trainers. Veterans. Meanwhile, Naomi was in keeping with the androgynous theme as she wowed in a cream suit from the French luxury designer, pairing the look with purple aviators and silver trainers earlier in the day while spotted out in Paris. The stunner drowned her svelte frame in an oversized shirt and trouser combo, undoubtedly from her own extremely successful eponymous clothing range, as she hit the streets in the midst of fashion week. Victoria looked sensational in her minimalist ensemble as she allowed her silhouette to do all the talking with the monochrome coloring. Perfectly styled, she wore her brunette locks in shoulder tickling curls while pulling on a pair of chic oversized sunglasses to mask her perfectly made up face. Chic, Victoria was flying solo earlier in the day, as she stepped out in Paris while looking every inch the style maven in too stylish. Ensemble spree or to her trip, it was revealed she teamed up with Sotheby's to temporarily host a selection of 16 portraits at the flagship store of her eponymous label ahead of the July 4th auction, and she's revealed that art has long been a passion for her and David. In an interview with the Daily Telegraph, the 44-year-old said, David and I loved collecting contemporary art for quite some time, but old masters is really something new for me, and something I don't know an enormous 
amount about describing the unprecedented collaboration with upscale auction house Sotheby's as a dream come true. The mother of four also went on to reveal that she and her husband have now become students of the classic works. All white, the stunner drowned her svelte frame in an oversized shirt and trouser combo undoubtedly from her own extremely successful eponymous clothing range. As she hit the streets in the midst of fashion week off we go, the stunner drowned her svelte frame in an oversized shirt and trouser combo as she hit the streets in the midst of fashion week walk this way, she was strutting her stuff as she departed the building in her stylish look the star also recently hit out against divorce rumors, gushing recently at the Forbes Women's Summit, I have the support of an incredible husband, we really are equal with everything we do at home with the children. When I'm away he's the one doing the school run and doing the cooking, once quoted saying, I just can't concentrate in flats, Victoria shocked. Attendees at her eponymous label's fall 2016 show in New York, when she took her final bow donning a pair of Adidas sneakers. Known for her signature sky-high stilettos, it seems that the designer will be hanging up her heels for good. Speaking to the Telegraph at the time, she said, I just can't do heels anymore. At least not when I'm working, Victoria had previously said, I beyond hate ballerina flats, however she has instead opted for sandals. The Dream, describing the unprecedented collaboration with upscale auction house Sotheby's as a dream come true, the mother of four also went on to reveal that she and her husband have now become students of the classic works Happy Days, she was chilling with her son Brooklyn just hours before.